Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Hey, hold on tight because I dive right in from the very first clip. So one of the things I learned from the last pour is that when I went corner to corner, I had no room to pull paint in the corner. I was like boxed in. So this time I'm going to lay the paint in a little bit of a swoop but not get to each corner. I'm gonna like start here and kind of arch down to there. And we'll see, uh, we'll see how this one goes. So I'm gonna voice over here in the interest of time and double time through this because you don't need to see me laying down all the paints in real time. So basically this first one is a blue, it's artist loft. Thalo Blue combined with DecoArt's Obsidian and some Golden Pearl to lighten it up a little bit. And one of the things I realized I mentioned through this section is the heat in this room is really, I think, thickening up the paints. Um, this color here is a black base that I was using the other day made of uh, Artist Loft's black and some Obsidian, DecoArt's Obsidian in there. This color here is a homemade peachy color, peachy rose. This next color here is uh, the Golden's Bronze. Yeah, I realized that it's about 85 degrees in the sunroom on this day, and all the paints just were seizing up on me, just thick. Okay, so this next color here is a lighter blue, and it's a combination of Arteza's Pearl Sky Blue Pearl Glacier Blue and Deco Arts Peacock Pearl. And then this next car color is the infamous Deco Arts 24 Karat Gold. And then after that, I've got my Golden Iridescent Pearl. And that finishes up the lineup for today. And I'm going to use the Document Protector as my swiping tool of choice this time. Uh, let's see what we can do here. So I've got my swiping utensils and let's go. Let's go smaller. to torch. Although I don't think there's much, any air bubbles in this. a lot easier getting near the edges here. I should have put less paint down. That was a learning from last time and I just forgot. 
Okay, let's uh, let's pull some of this paint this way, and then I'll be left with what little I need for the corner. like when it chatters like that. What I mean by chatter is the acetate piece doesn't go through the swipe nice and smooth. It just kind of chatters like creating ripples. And I'm thinking that might be because either number one, the paint is too thick, or number two, I didn't apply enough pressure when swiping. All right, let's try something different. I don't feel comfortable. There, that felt better. So now that you've been able to see the pace at which I pull the document protector through the paint at, I'm going to just pick up the pace again and go to double time in the interest of time. Thank you. 
want to. Just laid down a new base. I thinned down my base and I thinned down my paints. So let's give this another whirl. And I only added water. lighter on the blue. Still not thin enough. covered up my paint. All right, here we go. Give her another whirl. I don't think I've mentioned yet, but for my pouring medium, for my colors, I'm using about 60% Floetrol with about 35% Liquitex's gloss pouring medium. And then about 5% of the 
Golden's GAC 800. And when you use the, uh, the Gloss PM from Liquitex, it almost negates the need to put any kind of varnish afterward because it does leave a nice sheen on the artwork when you're done. And you'll see at the end of this when I post the final dry results. So here I'm tilting the canvas just to see how much paint I have on there and how much it's moving and whether or not it's safe to set it aside for drying. As I stand here looking at it, I whisper out a soft okay that sounded very resigned. And at this point, I think I've just given up on this one. In hindsight though, it actually looks pretty good. Now, the dried results turned out well. The first one was pretty good too. I just didn't give it a chance. Um, so live and learn. So I wanna thank everybody for stopping by. If you like it, go ahead and hit the like button. And if you would like to subscribe to my channel, go ahead and then you'll stay updated with the latest I put out. Stay tuned for more swipes because I'm not done with these guys yet. Thanks for watching. Take care.